This video is going to show you how to change a timestamp to a file. So first I'm going to show you how to change it, but there's going to be a minor issue. And then I'm going to show you a second way to change it. So right here you can see it's a PowerPoint presentation and it has a timestamp of 9-24-21. So let's open it real quick. And if I go to File, Info, you can see I have some more information. I know when it was created and when it was last modified. So let me go back. So one way that I can change it is I can go down here to my date and I can right click and tell it to adjust time, date and time. I'm gonna turn this off. I'm gonna turn it off to set time automatically and I'm gonna change the date. So let's change it to January 24th and let's put that in 2011 and I'll tell it to change. Okay, so then I can do a file, save as, and I'm going to call this one, same thing, but I'll put a one in front of it. And I'll tell it to save. Now if I go out here, you can see I did change the timestamp. It has the same name. It shows that it was modified on January 24th of 2011. So in that case, it looks like it should work. However, it really doesn't. Now let me change this back, my date back to normal. I'm going to tell it to set time automatically. I'm going to close it. And then I'm going to close out my PowerPoint. And when I open up this file, again, here my date looks good. But when I open it and I go to Info, it shows that it was modified in 2011, but it was actually created today. And that's because I did a save as. And that is the issue. And it shows that you've made a mistake with your whole sneaky factor. So let me show you how to fix that. So if I just copy this slide, let me change my date time again, right click and tell it to adjust date time, turn off setting the time automatically and change my date. Last time, let's put this in December 2015 and I'll tell it to change. Now let's create a new presentation. I'm going to paste it and now I'm going to save. All right, so let's close everything down. I'm going to change my time back. Okay. So here, I, this one is the second one that I created. You can see my timestamp is correct. I can even right click and go to properties. You can see when it was created, when it was modified. Let's see when this was created and modified. So this one actually looks fine until you open it and go to info. So let's open this and then go to info. And now you can see it was actually created in 2015 and then it was last modified in 2015. And that was it. So even though you think you've changed the timestamp, if you go to File Manager, it shows it is correct there. However, unless you actually copy and paste it and then save it, then your info will show today's date. All right, if you have any questions, please email me at learn at vegetarianhomeschooler.com.